Um, so thanks for joining me on this unboxing today because we are going to be opening a Barbie Petites Club. Um, so I've had this sat around for a few months now. My partner got this for me back in like the end of September. So it's been sat around for like a couple of months really. Um, it's been in the box. It's cute in the box, but I really want to open it and have a closer look. And I've been wanting to do a video on it and just haven't got around to it until now. So let's get going. Um, so first thing I want to let you know is that... Um, this was made in, I think, 2008. So, yeah, the Barbie Petites Club was sort of a toy range that was out about 10 or so years ago. And they're all like little mini Barbie dolls, as you can see. And this one in particular I absolutely love because it's a Hello Kitty theme. Uh, so she's just super cute and she's got, like, red hair. Uh, we've got a bit of glare from um, the camera and from the lighting. So let's get opening it so we can have a closer look. So it looks like there's, like, a little tab at the back. So I don't know if we can pull that and that does absolutely nothing. Um, okay, so I'm going to try to snip this open because these are quite fiddly and dangerous. Um, so hopefully I'll come back with all my fingers and I'll see you in a minute. Okay, um, so I was about to say we have a checklist so because I found this, but it's not. I think it's just a bit of card with a little Hello Kitty design on it. So I thought that was a checklist because usually they come with like... I've opened a few Barbie's Petites before. Um, have a look at my previous videos if you want to see those. I did two before. Um, and usually they come with like a little round checklist. But it doesn't appear like this one has that. Um, so I've taken it out of that first bit of casing. And then it looks like we should be able to just kind of pop this out. So here it is. Um, so this looks stunning. So I love the clear case. Um, it's nice to be able to sort of keep it in, in here away from dust and stuff. It comes with a nice little chain, so you could put it like on a backpack or a bag if you wanted to. Um, but I'm probably just going to display them like this. Yeah, I love this little chain. That's super cute with the little Hello Kitty design and the red beads. And then this looks quite nice as well. The actual bow looks slightly like crystal style, which is cute. Um, so let's actually see if we can open this up to have a closer look at our doll. <gasps> She's so cute. Oh my god. So I'm going to take the elastics off. Here she is. She is so cute. I love the hair. You don't often see dolls with like the sort of gingery strawberry blonde hair. So that's really cute. As you can see, it's in pretty mad curls, but I really love that. She's got lovely little purple kitty ears and then a cute little purple dress, tiny little legs, red shoes. And of course, she's holding a little Hello Kitty here. I think that's got like an elastic around it. So I think you don't really want to remove that. Otherwise, it wouldn't look like she's like cuddling it. Um, but yeah, that's so cute. I have this problem with these dolls every time that the hair feels like crunchy almost. I think it has got product in it and it is quite old. So I think that's just the way they are. But I do love the sort of pigtail look. Um, her fringe, I want to like tuck down a little bit. So I might, you know, try and restyle that a little bit. But even so, I think she's so, so, so cute. I love her. Um, and then because she's on like this little stand at the back, that can be clipped in here so you can see there's like a little hole there and then you can sort of push that in and she sits in there really well I like that I like that it's not just sort of you leave her in there there's actually a place so then even when you close it she's sort of got a set place which is really nice so you can move it around it's not gonna move around so I think they've planned that out really well that's really nice um I like the background as well it's sort of like ice lollies which is super cute um, and then we got a couple of extra bits with this. So let's have a little look at those. Okay, it looks like we've got a little ring, which is not going to fit my finger. Maybe it'll fit my little finger. Even then it won't. So we've got a tiny little Hello Kitty ring, which is really cute. And it comes on like a little keychain, so I think you can um, like hook it. Yeah, so it has like a little hole with the little key in there. So I think you could like hook that on the charm if you wanted to. actually does fit <laughs> can't get it off now okay maybe it doesn't fit ow <laughs> um and then we also have a little barbie charm which is quite cute so it's just like a little red heart with the barbie logo once again has that little charm bit so yeah these can just be clipped you know wherever you want at the top or hanging down there so that's quite cute that you have a couple of those little additions and i think that was everything so yeah so I absolutely love this. I'm so happy with this. I just love the way she sort of stands in there. That, like I said, it will protect her from dust and stuff, but you can still see through it. Love the background. Love the red colours. I love her hair. I mean, it's all amazing. Um, so this is like the best 
anniversary present ever <laughs> but yeah there she is once again she's just so cute i'm gonna sort uh, try to sort out that fringe a little bit i'd like it to be sort of down a bit more so that you can see her oh look there's a white bit a white bow so you couldn't see that before so i might try and like restyle her hair or try get it to stick down there that you can see more of that but yeah she's super cute i love her um so thank you so much for watching and um, please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this and let me know what you thought of this cute little doll down below i absolutely love her i have one more to do of these little barbie um mini petites um and it is another hello kitty styled one so subscribe if you'd like to see that and if you just love toys and dolls and all fun stuff in general subscribe and there'll be lots more of that coming i promise um but yeah thank you so much and i'll see you soon bye